Hey everybody, how's it going? So should I start this or you? You should start it. Okay, so we have managed to beat The Verge at failing to build a PC. Many of you have asked over the years, why is it after I'm done fixing a board, I don't reassemble the computer, and after 10 years, I'm gonna tell you the truth, because I can't assemble a computer, as can be seen here below and as Hi Hi will testify. So well, what, is, what is this project over here? This is a Corsair Carbide 540 case, and I had two issues with this case. The first is that the three and a half inch drive bays, which have their own SATA cable, were not working or functioning, and I needed to have drives that were not hanging out of the case. And the second issue that I had is that I couldn't put this front grill on for this particular radiator that I have because it would not fit. So I figured instead of having drives hanging out the side of the computer if I'm moving, I might as well get a proper case. Now there are a couple of things that happen because as you can tell from the way my floor looks, I don't know how to build a computer. Uh, issue number one is that this case, the, after putting this particular power supply into it, does not actually allow me to fit the three and a half inch bay into it. What happened when you tried to plug the three and a half inch bay in here for the hard drives? Well, you couldn't because the uh, power supply cables would get in the way of it. Yeah, so that, that, that's number one. Uh, number two is this does not allow you to put the dust filter in the case. Number three would be that when you're done with all this, you have to put, again, it's because of, I have two HDMI capture cards here that I put passive cooling on because the fan that comes with it is horrible. So I got these heat sinks, but it would not allow the card to fit with the power supply case. So we got this riser that seemingly doesn't fit at all. But above all, above all, the entire time, the reason that those two SATA bays were not working in that original case, which was half the reason that I was doing this to begin with, was not because the SATA bays in the Corsair Carbide case were bad, it was because I killed my motherboard SATA controller four years ago by plugging a test drive into it from a customer. <laughs> so at the end of the day, this entire thing, several days of time, were wasted for nothing. <laughs> How do you feel, Hi Hi? Uh, I feel great. Because <laughs> he's, the, admittedly, he's the one that's been helping me through, through this entire clusterfuck and trying to save my... Oh, yeah. Do you want to see, you want to see this drink? Oh, yeah, let's, yeah. what else uh, do you got? No, no, it's... Oh, uh, God. Back to the, back to the uh, capture card thing. Yeah, so I tried to put this riser in, and the other... <laughs> this is... <laughs> I can't build the computer to save my life. This is, this is great. Okay, time to start from scratch and get a different case. That's it for today, and as always... I hope you learned something. Work for somebody smarter. See you in the next video. Bye now.